crossing over with the angels. We said crossing over with the angels tonight. That's what I'm doing. Crossing over with the angels. Okay. Okay. Now, crossing over with the angels, that means that I'll be talking to the angels very shortly. And uh, after I talk to the angels, I'll be able to share something with you. Now, the hour, let me go to the hour of the angels. For you know the angels. We're talking about Michael, Raphael, Uriel, and the Archangel. We're talking about the angels of God. The angels that keep things working and keep the universe going. The angels control the universe and most of the things. I mean, the angels control that. Many things happen when the angels control. We're going to deal tonight with the angels and the angels that control things and keep things going. I want to be able to share some things with you tonight. Uh, some of the fallen angels, I ain't going to deal with the fallen angels. I'm not going to deal with the fallen angels. I'm going to deal with the angels for you. Oh, it's some scripture I want to give you to read. Dealing with the angel. Matthew 6 and 33. I want you to read uh, John 14 and 27. I also want you to read uh, John 10:10. 10, 10. I want you to read John 4 and 16. First uh, John uh, chapter 17. Uh, John 6 and 36. And also Philippians 4:13 and Philippians 4:19. I want you to read those. <coughs> that will be a blessing for you. As I tell you to read them tonight, these are some things I want you to read. I want you to be involved in that. It looks like when I just start to read and I get involved in my spirit stuff, all things break loose. My like spirit don't want me to share. <laughs> don't want me to share the blessing. That God has in store for you. And uh, I'm going to open up for you today. And I want you to get the blessing. That God. You, uh, I want to say to you. As I, as I close over with the angels. That's the angel Michael. Raphael Uriel. And most of the angels. <laughs> that be with me. The angel to come. Uh, uh, when I see the angels, they come back. Okay. Uh, and then sometimes the angels that I, I flag down, I be waving for the angels. If you see me waving, that's me waving for the angels. You might see an angel on this side of me, and then an angel on that side. I'm waving the angels by. You might can see them as they come by fast. And the angels coming, Michael Raphael, you hear, and they passing right by. You can see the angels moving, and they moving real fast. Michael Raphael, you hear, probably all the archangels. Then you see the angels move, and sometimes you see the angels coming up, and they move. And I'll be calling the angels forward tonight as I get ready to talk about crossing over with the angels. I would like to cross over with Michael. As I cross over with Michael tonight, Archangel Michael, Michael fight the devil. And when I speak to Michael, Michael is the fighter. Of all of those that do any evil, he fight them along with Gabriel. And Gabriel is, when I cross over to Gabriel, Gabriel is the angel over resurrection. He can go to the cemetery and tell you to get up. And then I go with Metatron. Metatron is the angel that works on the physical plane and the spiritual plane. When I go crossing over, I have Metatron with me. And as I talk to Metatron, Metatron is in the presence of God and Michael is in the presence of God. And Raphael 
angel, he's a healing angel. We have a trillion or so angels, he's the man. He's in the presence of God. And they go out at this hour to heal you from cancer, TB, tuberculosis, whatever. Uh, you got uh, Metatron is the angel that will make sure the angels do what they're supposed to do. Metatron is the king angel. But Metatron being the king angel, Metatron is in control of all the angels. So the angels must hear to what Metatron said. So when they listen to Metatron, they have to do what Metatron said. And Metatron uh, have them to uh, do certain things. So what they do in certain things, Metatron is the supervisor, or you would say he's the ball. Okay? Metatron keep things in order. Uh, Bob Gill is the angel of the elements. Michael is like God. And Bobby L is the blessing of God. UL is the light of God. Gabriel is the strength of God. And Jube is the peace of God. And Reviel is uh, the healing of God. And, the, and uh, Samuel is the prayer of God. Is all is take the orders from God. Uh, I want you to Matthew 6 and 33, seek first the kingdom of God, uh, Revelation chapter 7, and I want you to read uh, Exodus 23 and 20, God will send his angels. And I'm going to go over these angels for you, where you might know how to deal with these angels. These angels will go. For you, and, and I, as I cross over with these angels, these angels are very powerful. Uh, January, the angel of the angel that govern the twelve months of the year. January is Gabriel, G A B I R E L, or you can now say C A M B I E L. That's the month of. January, February is Bobby L, B A R C H I E L. That's the angel of February. So the angel of, of March is Michael. And April is Asmodeo. May is Andrea. And June is Muriel. July is Versailles. August is Hamiel, H A M A I L E. Hamiel is in the presence of uh, August. And September is Uriel, U-R-I-E-L, or Z-U-R-I-E-L, Uriel. October is Bobiel, Bobiel, B-A-R-B-I-E-L. October is Bobiel. November is Andrew. And that's A D A N I C H E L or A D V A I C H I E L. And December is Hamiel. That's H A N A E L or A N A E L. Hamiel. That's the angel of 12 months. So I'm looking for you to have these angels and be able to look at these angels to work with you. The angels of the hour. Uh, right now, the angel is Michael on ship, and that these very Michael, Ravi, Muriel, Samuel, all the angels deviate. As I cross over with the angels, the angels carry me to different levels that I've never been. Angels carry me to levels where I have never experienced and never been. And when they carry me to these levels, they bring me back to give me information. And the information they give me is the information that they bring, uh, and they bring it to me where I can work with it. So I want to let you know, your healing, your deliverance, I'm praying for you, Carolyn, I'm praying for you, uh, Francis, I'm praying for you, uh, Joanne, I'm praying for you, and Tina, I'm praying for you. Uh, the Lord, I'm praying for you. 
Robert, and I'm praying for you. As I go on this journey tonight, uh, this crossing over, I'm invoking the angels, Michael Raphael. I'm invoking the angels to go to Detroit, to go to St. Louis. I'm invoking the angel, Michael, and the whole angel to go bring the truth out. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy this is Bishop Colonel. Go to my website, scdbabyhamyourcite.com. And put you on my web, uh, go to my home page, go to my blog talk radio. I'm on five days a week. I'm on Monday, Stock Martin King Movement. I'm on Tuesday, Clark Over's Answer from 11 to 12. And I'm on Wednesday, Pastor Ella, all the way from Minnesota. And she's on from 7 to 8 uh, every Wednesday. And on Thursday, we have Brother White. Natchez, Mississippi, and Fayette, Mississippi. It's on from 11 to 12, breaking up the Bible and making the Bible more livable to you. Friday, I'm, I'm doing visions and dreams on Friday from 11 to 12 of 30 minutes, and then I'm going into the trillion dollar flow. Who got the money? Where the money at? And we're going to be doing some thinking about how much money is being spent on natural disaster, how much money is being moved out. How much money has been spent over in Israel where they're trying to rebuild? Where all that money coming from? We cannot do, we cannot afford to do lots of foreign aid, foreign aid care, no home aid. So we need to take care of some business here at home. And I think that's the most important thing in Detroit, Chicago, Mississippi, Alabama. We need to take care of the people that's here, that's, that's crying now. We need to take care of our young folks, keep them from in the street. Looting and robbing when they need jobs. If you had some jobs, that wouldn't happen. So I'm asking you and you to be involved. The thing can go over and come up with the killer. Uh, who killing all these people? So if we come in and pray about that, God going to do it. Father God, we come in the name of Jesus. We thank you for every lesson. Bless the children that go back to school and them going back to college. Let them be their sex in college and school. We'll bring the negative energy each way of mouth and job in the name of Jesus. Bless the school. I'm coming to the at the other school. Bring peace and clothes in the name of Father, whom in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And I thought I'd pray for you, and that would help you and give me closure. As I cross over with Michael Raphael, Bobby Ahemia, and all the archangels, and I had the angel spirit Moses. The angels get moved to a secret place and they buried him. And I want to let you know angels is existing. Angels move back towards the universe. And when you see the present angels, sometimes angels are giant, sometimes angels are very small, sometimes angels don't say nothing. But there is angels among us. There is angels walking with us today. As I speak to angels that knocking on your door, there's angels protecting what they end up with all their angels. Angels of the devil, you have to put them down. Once you put them down, man, you're all right. I know what they I know I look to the spirits and I get them close and I act on them. So I do that and I grab them right there. Things work out. I thank God for the blessing for you. I want you to go knowing so and so in the right direction. Get ready for God to bless you. Get ready every cross over to Angel Michael, Raphael, Bobby, and all the angels in the presence of God. I want you to read Psalms 119, East, West, North, and South. And the angel bringing me another scripture. Psalms 139. Psalms 139. I'm going to read that. Exodus uh, 20 and 28. And read that. It will be a blessing for you. As we get ready to move to the next level, I will cross it over. And uh, as I cross over, uh, the angel was telling me about how some of this stuff go down. So I'm giving a good sense on how witchcraft and try to take over, but it can't. But the angels got it covered. Now I want to tell you, I want you to go north, so on the floor, and God says, this is your blessing. I want you to kind of see tonight. I want you to kind of see today. I want you to plant a seed to this ministry. Go to the CD Baby Ambulance and go to the homepage. All the information on the homepage. 
but I want you to plant a seed. Little or small, I want you to do it quick, fast. I want you to plant that seed and get it in the ground where we can pray on and pray on. I want you to plant that seed. Get that seed. If you got me, plant a seed. And some of you got me, so plant your seed. I want to pray for you. I want to make sure that everything moves in the fine order for you, quick, fast, and